Well, hey there, everybody. It's Lori McLean. This week's episode of RA Raw is going to be really crappy. I'm not going to lie. It is going to be crappy. Somewhat of a confessional, I suppose. I guess I call it a confessional. So I've been using Gutley Probiotics for six weeks now. I've always had what I call the finicky bowel. In fact, I did an episode last year, the year, yeah, I did an episode over a year ago. Um, I was slated to have a colonoscopy because there have been some things come back in my fit exam. Anyways, it turned out fine and I found out that everything looked really good down there, but I still, still dealt with frequent bathroom trips. So I've known for years that it's irritable bowel syndrome. And yeah, it's just something that I have learned to live with because it seemed no matter what I did, it was always an issue. But I know what things definitely will trigger my bowel. And if I have ice cream, mm, yeah, it'll cause an issue. Some spicy things, mm, yeah, definitely, definitely nuts. Definitely cause an issue. So when I started Gutley Probiotics, I, I didn't know what to expect. I thought, well, we'll see, you know, see if it helps my inflammation. And when I thought of inflammation, I thought of my joints. Uh, my inflammation rate usually hovers around a four, 4.2. And my doctor classifies that as remission. So, you know, I thought, well, maybe we'll see a difference in, in the numbers when it comes to checking my inflammation. I was curious about that. And I thought, well, maybe it might increase my energy because I'd read that probiotics can help with lack of energy, which I still struggle with from time to time. So I didn't have high expectations for the probiotics. I was excited to try them, most definitely. You know, for the first week, I thought I was taking them as directed, four squirts of liquid probiotic every morning. I wasn't really noticing any difference. Um, nothing huge, you know, I was like, well, all right. So it's going to take time. I knew that. The end of the second week into the third, I started to notice a difference, guys. And the difference was in my bathroom habits. So we've all seen that chart that goes around Facebook. I think it's called the Bristol chart or something like that. And it's, you know, bad poop and then optimum poop. I, I always knew I was going to be about, you know, one or two up at the top. I wasn't going to be down at optimum poop. No way. No matter what I did. I just resigned myself to the fact that I wasn't going to be an optimum pooper. That's how it was. Oh, well. Life goes on. We can't all be everything. Well, like I say, at the end of the second week into the third week, I started to notice a difference. I was going less and less and less. And I never realized that I was bloated. I had no idea. I thought it was just weight. I didn't know. Well, lo and behold, I guess I was a bit bloated for like a long time. And my stomach would always pop and hiss and gurgle. It was embarrassing at times. God, the worst times. Weddings, funerals, there'd be my stomach talking away well it doesn't do that anymore if it does it usually means i'm hungry so that's a bonus and as far as the poop chart goes i can report i am an optimum pooper i finally did it yes so excited about that you have no idea i'm really happy because I can now, I can make more of these videos and I won't always talk about poop, but in this one we are. What our habits in the bathroom look like? Well, that's indicative of really what's going on inside of our gut. And if your gut's not working, then you're not going to be an optimum pooper, apparently. I tried everything. So I thought. But I hadn't. Because I hadn't tried gutly probiotics. I've been on different probiotics in the past. You know, the big jug of ones that you get at Costco. They're cheap, so I thought, well, what the hell? I may as well try them. i got nothing to lose. And yeah, I might have noticed maybe a bit of a difference, but not like this, guys. Not like this. I'm telling you, I was not 
an optimum pooper when I was taking the Costco probiotics. Nothing against Costco. God, I don't want to get them mad at me, but I'm just saying that the Gutley probiotics. Anyways, try them. They do work. If nothing else, it'll increase your energy. And I know that I feel a hell of a lot better because my stomach's not talking all the time. That's a good thing. At least it is for me. You know, if you like that sort of thing, if you like your stomach gurgling and popping and hissing at the most inopportune times, church, weddings, funerals, you know, then go for it. Keep your gut the way it is. But I'm telling you, I've lived with RA for 40 years and I didn't know that my gut felt this bad. I didn't. I was kind of ignoring it, actually. I just, you know, it was a joke. People knew. Like, you know, my family knew that if we go out somewhere to eat and if it's a little bit greasy, we're going to have to zoom right home because Lori's going to have to use the facilities. I mean, I've, I've trained everybody and, well, I go somewhere out to eat. And if it's bad, if I, if I choose to be a little daring and not have a salad, that there's a good chance that I'm going to have to zoom on home because I'm going to have to go to the bathroom. So, yeah, that's, that's what that always looked like. But now it's different. <laughs> God, I can actually report to you that I was able to go out with my son and my wife and we were able to have hot wings. That's right, hot wings. Now, I love them, but I have never eaten them outside of the house. No way, no how. Was not going to happen. But now I can. I can eat hot wings out in public. Yay! No, it's not a lot because as you know, I always say, you know, don't eat that food. It's not good for you. Blah, blah, blah. It's going to raise your inflammation. Well, it will. But if you just want to live a little sometime and not have to worry about rushing home, gutly, it, it's helped me. I, I don't have to worry as much anymore about what I eat in public. And I know my wife is really happy because she doesn't have to drive like a bat out of hell to get me home. I don't want to seem over dramatic here, guys, but they've changed my world. They really have. I, I can't believe it how much they have changed my world. Anyway, it's I've talked about Optimum Poop and I've talked the personal stuff for too long. So there's the link. And if you want to go get yourself some Gutley probiotics, it's RA Raw 10 at the checkout and you'll get to save 10% off, which is great. It's really great. Anyways, I'll see you all next week. And I'm going to be back to talking about the other gut health stuff because it's a really big subject and I think we really need to focus on it. So we're going to, I'm going to. And if you're squeamish, I hope you turned this video off in the beginning. I'm just saying. Anyway, everybody take care. Bye for now. That got two peace signs because number two.